Good evening, it's Adria. I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you've had a nice day. Uh, it's beautiful here. I'm in Ohio. A um, lot of changing leaves and, and crisp, cool nights and mornings, and, and I, I love that. But um, I want to talk about the power of intention. I want to remind you of the power of intention. And just a, just a little example to kind of <clears throat> uh, kind of bring it out and, and, and for understanding. Let's say we're intentioning a candle, something very, very simple. And this is relating, obviously, to witchcraft. Let's, let's say we're intentioning a candle. We think of what we want to create. We focus on these thoughts. We feed these thoughts. These thoughts become the now. And we feel this emotion that we are creating with our thoughts, this energy. Emotions are energy. But the, the particular emotion is the assignment of the energy. It is the definition, the purpose of the energy. So the phrase, the power of intention, we all have this power this chi, <clears throat> this energy, this spirit within us. We are energy. The power of intention. How we intention our energy is what creates our reality. And I want to remind you that we intention ourselves every day, whether we realize it or not. That's why I'm reminding you. That's why it's a reminder I'm supposed to talk about it. <clears throat> we intention ourselves every day. So, by bringing this to light, by reminding you, by bringing illumination onto something that has been forgotten, and what has been forgotten, that we have the power to create a reality. I'm expressing and, and, and stressing and reminding. This is another way. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm sorry. This is another way of creating a reality. This intention, intentioning our energy, intentioning our focus, what we want to do, what we are going to choose to do, what we are in control of doing, not others. I put a little clip up today about creating our reality. And we gain control. We are in control when others are not controlling us, when we release control of outside sources, that's when we become in control of us. When we are reacting to others, when we are um, basing our, our self-worth or, or our self-definition on what we are receiving from others, for examples, they are controlling us. What if they are gone? Then what would you decide? What would you feel? What would you think about yourself? Reclaim your power. Reclaim your power. Release them. Whatever has been inflicted upon you, that's not you. That's not you. Embrace who you are right now. Know that you are, are empowered that you have free will, that you are in control of creating your reality, that you are a creator, that you are a magical, beautiful, powerful spirit that is meant to connect and to create. What do you want to see? What do you want to feel? What do you want to experience? Intention yourself and do it intentionally. Awareness is illumination. That is when the gates open. When awareness happens and you realize, you realize when you're in control or when you're being controlled or when you are creating your reality, when you are manifesting, when you see this happening, it, it will fill you up. It will absolutely raise your vibration. Fuel to the soul. 
fuel your soul intentionally. Decide. Make your choice. Do you want to feel love? Then focus on loving. Focus on being loved. Focus on what you love and what creates love and be love. Do you want to be happy? What makes you happy? What makes your heart sing? What raises your vibration? What's calling you? Don't depend on others to make your choices. Don't do that because you're selling yourself short. Then you're living through others. You're not living for yourself. That's where unfulfillment, where void, where self-dismissal, where that happens. That's what you're creating by, by letting yourself be defined and, and choosing, you're still choosing, based on others, on outside sources, outside situations and influences. So, so I want to remind you of how powerful you are on a daily basis. I want you to remember every day. It's not just a matter of, okay, I'm going to go ahead and take this on and decide that I have power. It's more than that. You're already there. You're already there. You're already that. You're already powerful. You are already energy. It's a matter of remembering that you define it. You're so beautiful, and, and you're so strong, and you're magical, and you are a creator. So, um, that's the message, in a nutshell, I guess. I try not to talk too much, and I know I do, but um, I say what I'm passionate about, and I, and I want you all to succeed, and to manifest, and to feel how powerful you really are, what you're meant to do meant to create. I hope you have a blessed, beautiful evening. May blessed be.